What's up, YouTubers? Johnny DIY here. Today I'm going to be showing you how to do a simple roll on texture and a knockdown finish on the drywall. Alright, so you're going to put your compound in a bucket or your mixing tray and we're going to add a little water to it. And we're going to stir it up until it gets like a nice thinnish pancake batter consistency. Alright, I got it to the consistency I want. Now we're just going to take our normal paint roller. Now this is a three quarter inch nap roller. You'll see it uh, labeled for like a stucco masonry finish. You could use a half inch or you could use three eighths inch if you just want it to give it a dimple finish. That won't knock down at all. But this three eighths will give us a nice knock down finish like this over here. I've already done this area. But we're just going to roll it on, load up our roller, nice and good. So we're going to roll it on. You can go kind of any direction. You just want it to even out the amount of thickness that you're putting it on. Alright, so it's been about 10-15 minutes and depending on the consistency, the temperature that you're applying, uh, your time will vary. But we're just going to take our 12 inch knife and we're just going to drag it lightly, not, you know, even amount of pressure over the finish. What this is going to do is it's going to um, take all those little peaks. and it's going to knock them down. If you let this stuff set up longer, you can still knock it down, but you'll have to use more pressure. All right, so this is what the texture looks like when you're finished. Texture's all dry, and now we can apply our primer, and then our paint. All right, so here's how the texture turned out all painted. Looks great. So that's how easy it is to roll on texture, guys. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. Check out my other videos. I'd really appreciate it. Thanks for watching Johnny DIY, guys. Keep on doing it yourself. Take care.